Hey guys, welcome back to the 100 Baby Challenge in The Sims 3. We are on episode number 3, and we are right where we left off last week with Taylor in labor. Let's go ahead and send her to the hospital. Oh, I see we're still having this. Okay. Yes, let's call a babysitter for Abel. Eric, what are you doing? Why don't you keep painting? Hey, Taylor. Yep, just walk right through the bushes. Babysitter better get there soon, because Abel needs some stuff. Eric's fine, but he can take care of himself. Okay, so last time we had baby Abel. Eric aged up a couple times. So we have Emmanuel now lined up next. Taylor has two days until she's an adult. Eric has just improved his painting skill to level four. What's his grade? He has a C. Congratulations on a new baby boy. Baby was born with the genius and athletic traits. What would you like to name him? Let's see, let's go with Jesse. Okay, let's take baby Jesse home. Good job, Taylor. Oh, lied. I don't know why I like him so much. Oh, babysitter took care of Abel. Thank goodness. Oh, it's because it's not the same guy. Maybe Brandy actually knows what she's doing. She's just gonna sit on her phone, but she's at least watching Abel, so that's all that matters. We need another crib. Oh, the little fish, that's cute. Only had boys so far. I certainly hope that we have a girl soon. Otherwise, the challenge is gonna be over real quick. Put Jesse in the crib. <laughs> um, Clyde? Hey. Is he evil? Oh, what is he doing with Abel? Clyde? Oh. Is it his birthday? Uh, do. Oh. Mm -hmm. oh, Clyde? Can't be friends with Clyde anymore. He just put Abel on the ground. Just to steal candy from him. Taylor, come pick up Abel. Put him back in the crib. And then... Get Clyde out. He's he's in trouble right now. I can't believe he would do that. Unbelievable. Ask to leave. Clyde, you have to go. Play Emmanuel over. Sure, I'll come over in a little while. While I'm thinking about it. Cancel the newspaper Joshua. delivery service. Is that Emmanuel? It is. He's here. Let's have a little chat with him. Do you want to sleep over? You know, just in case Taylor passes out. Thanks for inviting me over. Oh, he likes the flirting. Let's see how much flirting we can do before Taylor passes out. First kiss. He's a romantic interest now. And to think these two met because Taylor almost burned down the house. Propose going steady. Let's go for it. Try for baby. He's probably going to pass out actually before they can do that. We'll see. Here they go. Maybe. I'm slightly concerned with how broken my game is already. Okay, let's see. Nope. No baby. Taylor's gonna have to sleep for a little while. Toy oven. Taylor, are you sure you don't want a real oven first? Oh, look at this guy. You didn't get her pregnant. You can't strut around like that. It's Abel's birthday! Happy birthday, Abel! <laughs> uh, Taylor, I need you to get up and feed Abel. And then Taylor, take care of Jesse real quick. Eric, you can go to sleep, bud. Taylor, I know you're tired. Oh no, Emmanuel. Wake up. Oh, he's awake. Oh, she has to change Jesse's dirty diaper real quick. She'll be right in, Emmanuel. I guess we're not trying for baby. That's fine. Just go to sleep. Go to sleep, Taylor. Or get some food, I guess. That's fine too. Taylor, Jesse is up. I'm sorry, Eric. Okay, Taylor, put Jesse back in his crib. Yeah, Abel, what go. are you doing? Why are you outside? Taylor, put Abel to bed. Eric, go to school. The second I'm gonna do it. Okay, let's see. Is there a baby? Yes. Now, break up with him. Manuel is hot headed. Clyde wants to chat. Can't really stay mad at Clyde. He did steal candy from my baby though, and I'm not gonna forget that. I guess Abel's hungry, so feed him. Oh look, this painting has already appreciated some value. 
And this one. Um, we just need to get to the consignment wasn't, store. Wasn't me Gaza. Start Whoa. selling these. <laughs> Jesse has a dirty diaper. Uh, Taylor kind of has some needs, doesn't she? How about you keep potty training Abel a little bit though? I would like her to just paint all day, but she does kind oh, of gosh. have some other needs maybe she needs to take care of. But if she could actually potty train Abel, Davo! Bekendova! First thing, that would be Davo. useful. After you finish that, put him to bed. Newell is just heartbroken over Taylor. Why don't you leave? Do not take Abel out of the crib. Taylor, tell him to leave. This is unacceptable. Abel, where are you going? Who's calling? Glove, glove, glove. Nobody interesting. Okay. Then go to sleep. Let me finish his homework. Good job, Eric. Go on a submarine adventure. It'll be fun, right? Oh, we have bills to pay. There's a letter for Taylor from Emmanuel. Sorry, Emmanuel. It's Jesse's dirty diaper. Change Abel's dirty diaper. Continue body training, Abel. Have a good day at school, Eric. Mornings are so chaotic around here. Maybe it's just all the time. This whole challenge is just chaotic. Empty that. Potty train Abel. He's getting really close. Tomorrow is Eric's birthday. So we'll age him up. He'll be a teenager. He can babysit. Then Taylor can go to the consignment store and drop off her paintings and hopefully meet someone there. Abel is making great go. progress. Taylor just found out she's pregnant. Uh -huh. Again. <laughs> Abel nip, nip. is hungry and tired. It's Taylor, actually. Mm. Let's take a break from learning, get some food, take a nap. Oh, you can make peanut butter and jelly sandwiches? That would be good. Why don't you serve some of those? So we have some leftovers for Eric when he gets home. We're still able to pay the bills right now. I think that's the most important thing. What you doing? Grab a plate. You just made the plate of sandwiches and I was just staring at it. And Jesse needs some attention. And then put Abel to bed, and then take a nap. He's up. Eric's home. Why don't you work on a painting? You don't need to do your homework or anything. Oh, he got an A! Okay, let's let Taylor sleep for a little bit, and we'll age Eric up. Oh, Taylor, Jesse is hungry. So why don't you get up now? Now, Eric, blow out the candles. It's Eric's birthday. Once again, he was able... No, Taylor, what are you doing? It's Eric's birthday. Can she not get in there? We need to take down these walls. Actually, I think I should, anyways. Wow, that gives a lot of money. <laughs> Happy birthday, Eric! Eric has reached his teen years. Because of his success in school, he may choose a trait for Eric. So he's disciplined and a technophobe and family oriented. He was born with a couch potato trait, too. I don't know why he only has three traits. Wow, that's quite the look. I'm just gonna leave it, though. Maybe eventually... I'll start, like, giving the kids makeovers and stuff, but... It's a lot of work, and I don't really have much CC right now. Oh, hey, Eric. Before you go to sleep, could you change Jesse's dirty diaper? This is so nice. Taylor can actually get a full night's sleep. Let's just replace the stove, yep. That's about the money that we got from tearing down the walls. This game is so silly sometimes, but it's okay. Eric, you're fine. Why don't you go take a bath? Abel! He's having a meltdown. Don't worry, Taylor is getting to you. There's only so much she can do. Empty that out. Oh, he just... It's fine. Change his dirty diaper and then potty train him anyways. I'm just gonna go back to sleep, that's fine. Eric's gonna try to go back to sleep. Abel, it's okay. Is Abel almost potty well trained? Done, babe. Let's see. Love the girl. Oh, okay. Are you teaching him how to walk? Or maybe she was teaching him how to talk. Doesn't matter. Does it? He needs to learn everything. God. It's Jesse's birthday. Deja Mola. Oh no. Oh, a snow day. Deja Actually, no, that's Mola. totally fine. Almost there. Come on, Abel. Oh, Taylor's gonna have an accident. Okay, yeah, go. Sorry, Taylor. Eric can continue teaching Abel how to talk. Abel has learned how to talk. Thank you.
Thanks, Eric. You, uh, finish body training, Abel, too? Oh, here we go. You see, Nubu. There it is. Abel has been potty trained. Now he just needs to learn how to walk. And it's Jesse's birthday, too, so he's gonna be a toddler today. We could just start teaching him everything, too. Taylor needs to go to sleep for a bit, though. Taylor, you broke the bathtub. Let's take a break. We're kind of painting for a little bit. And then put Abel to bed. Taylor really needs a better bed. She gets no energy when she sleeps. Taylor, let's go to the consignment store. Eric, could you please take care of Jesse? This teenager oh. thing is great. Okay, who do we have here? Consort? Cap? What the heck kind of name is Consort? I don't care what anyone else thinks. I think you're hot. Let's see. So Can she just like flirt with him already? Oh, he is not into that. Oh. He is in a relationship. Who's this? Marilyn? Hello, Marilyn. I don't know why you had to come behind the counter. It's not really what you're supposed to do, but that's okay. okay let's consign the paintings first. <gasps> There's a horse outside. We are never going to have a horse in this challenge, so that's just not going to happen. No! The store is closed! A waste of time. Okay, fine. Let's go somewhere and try to meet somebody, I guess. Go to the museum. Are there not people here? Caroline Morgan. Hello, Caroline Morgan. How are you? What's consort? Who's this? Samantha. Samantha Cassett. Hello, Samantha. Let's just let's just go right to it. Are you single? She is. It's Jesse's birthday. Happy birthday, Jesse. Oh, Eric, you have not been taking care of yourself. He was cooking. That's so cute. Taylor, you don't like seem to be doing a very good job with Samantha here. Yeah, block, What's going on? That's She's leaving. Is there anybody else here? I don't know why I keep coming here. Taylor, just go home. Oh, he made an autumn salad. Can you just let Abel out of the crib? He can just play or whatever. Abe is now an elder. I wonder when Taylor's gonna have her baby. Oh, goodness. Uh... Sorry, Eric. Uh, but would you mind feeding toddlers? Um, I know Abel woke you up, and that's not cool. But if you could feed them so they don't keep screaming, then you can go back to sleep. You know, he's probably gonna have this another snow day. The snow hasn't stopped. So feed both of them and then finish the painting, if you don't mind. Abel can use the potty chair on his own. Look at him being a big boy. Oh, this is great. There he goes. Oh, we, we don't need to be looking that closely at him. Jesse doesn't know any skills yet. Jesse, you're fine. No screaming. Wait, Eric can finish teaching Abel um, how to walk. Eric, you're great. Thanks for being exactly who I need right now to help Taylor through this challenge. He really needs to just get some sleep, but... It's taking forever. He's a better bed. 190 simoleons. Good job, Eric. So I'm gonna finish teaching Abel how to walk. It's a snowflake day. Is the consignment store closed today because it's snowflake day? It better not be. We really need to sell these paintings. Abel has just learned how to walk, which means it's time for his birthday. So Abel still has three days until his actual birthday, but. He knows how to walk, how to talk, and how to use the potty chair. So, it's his birthday. Abel Conroy is having a birthday party. Oh, Jesse. Oh, he has a dirty diaper. We'll take care of that in a second. Taylor, you're just gonna put the cake on the floor? Don't do that. Mm. Happy birthday, Abel! Shabby! Oh, he's coming! Oh my gosh! Oh, he's coming! Oh, he's coming! Oh, he's Eric's freaking out. Hey Taylor, let's go to the hospital. Happy birthday, Abel. Uh, seen a little bit. <laughs> your brother or sister. Look at timing though, because now we don't have to buy another grip. Eric, can you take care of Jesse, please? Happy birthday, Abel. Due to your excellent parenting skills, you may now choose a trait for Abel to develop. So he is a light sleeper, disciplined, and has no sense of humor. Let's go, Taylor, to the hospital. We just get bills. I saw the mailman. She's really hungry. Are they gonna feed her at the hospital? 
Maybe not, because she's in labor. Good luck, Taylor. Congratulations on a new baby girl. Okay, this is good because now I can officially continue the challenge. I was worried there for a sec. I mean, this probably isn't going to be our next matriarch, but it could be. Okay, baby girl. We are going to go with Riley. Again, thank you, Allison, for suggesting that one. I really like that name for a girl. Riley was born with the brave and clumsy traits. And remember, I am always looking for baby names. If you have any suggestions, leave them in the comments below. Okay, let's take Riley home. Riley is hungry. So I'm making some grilled cheese. Don't start another fire. I'm gonna watch her really closely this time. Learn painting skill. Abel, that is such a great idea. He must be a vocal legend too. How you doing, Taylor? Someone's calling. Who's calling? Someone's inviting her to a party. We're not going to a party. Clyde Reeves' party. Oh, we should go to Clyde's party. Okay, kids, here's some... Um, is that burned? Oh, it's normal. Okay, here's some grilled cheese. Taylor's gonna go to a party. Happy Snowflake Day. Oh my gosh. It's so hard to, like, actually celebrate holidays in this challenge. But I think that Taylor possibly meet somebody at Clyde's party because, you know, her and Clyde are kind of friends. Clyde just should never come over to her house anymore after the whole candy stealing incident. Is this where Clyde lives? Who is this? Oh, that's Gabe! Oh, he's an elder. Elliot! Elliot's an elder too. Um, is that Clyde? Why is Clyde sleeping at his own party? Is that the only people that are here? Are her ex-boyfriends? Grab a plate of this. Oh, it's a pizza. Yeah, grab some pizza. Is anyone else gonna show up? We can't have babies with these guys. We've already had babies with them. Plus, they're elders. And, um, you never know what's gonna be too much physical activity for elders. Okay, fine. Let's just go to the consignment store. Hopefully it's still open. Maybe it's not open because it's a holiday. I don't know. Hey, Taylor, thanks for coming to my party. No problem, Clyde. You were asleep the whole time, though, which is kind of weird. So she couldn't really talk to you? Oh, it's Samantha! Proof! Wigs out! Why don't you like me, Samantha? Hello. I Arna, um, would like to do Kyle some business Johnson. with you. Mm -hmm. I have some things mm, I think that? you might like to sell. Mm. Let's consign all of these. Is she laughing at me? This is so rude, Marilyn. Is there anybody else around? Oh, no, Jesse. Eric, could you please... Uh, take care of Jesse. Also, Riley needs some attention as well. Okay, back to Taylor. Thanks, Eric. You're the best. This is not going well. Um, let's go somewhere else. Where can we go? Is there like a bar or something? Luminous bar. I don't know. We just really, we really need to meet somebody. Get her pregnant again. Congratulations! Oh, we already sold three paintings. With 734 simoleons. She got promoted a couple times. Ooh, look at that money. Oh, we can buy the trait now. Extra creative. The finest paintings are created by those who are not only creative, but extra creative. Buy that, and then she'll make higher quality paintings, and we'll sell those at the consignment store and just make so much money, and then hopefully we'll be able to move uh, into a little bit bigger house. I don't really want to do any renovations on this house, but I will if I have to. How much is fertility treatment? 10,000. Maybe we should buy that. It would be really useful. I wasn't really expecting anybody to be here, but I was kind of hoping maybe someone will show up. Maybe someone will show up. There's still nobody here. What's this? Drink triple banana light latte with caramel swirl. Yes. <gasps> Who's this? Oh, is that Gabe? Oh, Michael Dandy. Um, he's an elder and he's also leaving. Michael is going home in a limo. Um, maybe we missed out on an opportunity there. What is that? No, stop playing that music. Nothing happens. No, everything's okay. Except, uh, nobody's here. Can she just, like, go to someone's house? Is that too awkward? So let's go to the gym. Drink some coffee and then hit the gym. Maybe we'll meet someone there. I know it's snowflake day, so, like, maybe people are just at home with their families. Which Taylor should be, but she also doesn't really have time for that. Oh, we have bills to pay. Eric, can you pay this for us, please? 69 smoleons. That is not bad at all. Taylor, what are you doing? She's showering at the gym. I mean, I guess that's fine. Who's calling? Is someone calling? Someone is calling. Is someone calling to ask her out? Chat with Emmanuel. No. I don't really want 
want to chat with Emmanuel. Is there anybody here? Francisco? Look here. Is everybody in this town old now? That was gonna work out a little bit. Good for you. Shirley Templeton. Let's try talking to Mark. Maybe Let's know. he Let's got go. separated Let's from his wife. Mm. Like, I'm pretty sure he was married. Like she met him on her Mama first day here. Let's just ask. Him. He's single. Is this not the same guy? Don't um, flirt with him right away. I'm pretty sure this is the same guy. Taylor is so tired. Like, sorry. She needs to get her relationship up a little bit, and then she can go home. We should get her pregnant again. He's such a good big brother. He's putting he Riley in that crib. Me. Can we use that crib now? Is it not broken anymore? Are they both gonna sleep in Taylor's bed? Oh, Eric just walked right through it. Um, maybe the game is still broken. I don't know what to think anymore. Let's just do a little bit of flirting. Okay, say goodbye and then go Naji. Home. You, um, let Jesse out real quick and then go to sleep. Cause he's kind of just sitting there in the dark. Why did she change back into that? Okay, Eric, uh, you're pretty fully rested. Can you give Riley some attention and then, and, um, I guess do a painting? Oh, Abel went back to sleep in his own bed. Oh, Eric, can you feed Jesse? Abel, I'm so sorry. He's had a really rough night. He's not gotten any sleep. Jesse! Please mm. stop screaming. It's Taylor's birthday! Oh no. Can we get her pregnant again? Before she ages up? Oh, another snow day. What a surprise. Eric, can you start teaching Jesse how to walk? Taylor, answer the phone. I need to know who this is. <gasps> it's Mark! That's exactly who I wanted to be calling. Mark would like to chat. Yes. Wow, that was a short conversation. Change Riley's dirty diaper. Looks like this crib is not broken anymore. That's fantastic. Uncle Riley was ecstatic to hear the great news. He has sent Riley Roy, a friend from his magic toy factory to keep Riley company. Uncle Riley was ecstatic to hear about the arrival of Riley. Eric, he changed Jesse's dirty diaper. Poor Abel was still so tired. Um, and then teach him how to walk. Let's just teach them as quickly as possible. We have all these snow days and Eric doesn't have a job. Might as well take advantage of his time not being at school. Can we invite Mark over? He does not want to come over. Okay, that's fine. Taylor, go to sleep. Abel, you should also take a nap. Just let Josie play with Toy for a little while. You can take a bath. How's Riley doing? Riley is... Okay. Congratulations! You sold another painting. It's almost six o'clock on a Friday and everyone is in bed. That's how the Conroys like to celebrate the weekend. <laughs> Taylor's birthday! Woohoo! Oh, happy birthday, Taylor! Good Mimi! Taylor is now a fully mature, at least some of the time, adult. Can't believe it. Oh no, Taylor's having a midlife crisis. Halfway through her part of the challenge now. She's an adult. Uh, let's give her a quick makeover. None of these seem quite right. Let's go with that one for now. No, she needs to keep the overalls, but we can give her a second outfit. Dip toggy. Let's go with that. No, I don't really want to change any of her other outfits. So I just want to make sure that they're the same. Don't have much CC, so it's not like I have very many options anyways. So, new hairstyle, second everyday outfit. Everything else exactly the same. I believe Taylor is an adult now. Halfway through her part of the challenge, she's had four kids. We're going to have quite a few matriarchs in this. I'm going to go ahead and leave this episode right here. Thank you so much for watching. We have had four, so we have 96 to go. If you are not already, be sure to subscribe so you see whenever new episodes come out. You can follow along with the rest of the 100 Baby Challenge. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a fantastic day, and I'll see you all later. Bye, guys.